A diet win for me used to be watching the numbers on the scale go down. I was all excited. Yay, I'm going to be skinny. And then the numbers would go up and I'd get disappointed. And sometimes I'd try again. Most times I wouldn't. I'd just watch those numbers and just be so disappointed in myself. It was just easier just to eat. I liked my food too much. Sometimes the numbers would continue to drop. I'd notice how the changes in my clothes would fit. There were even times I'd go as far as getting rid of my fat clothes, spending money on all kinds of new things, only for the pounds to creep back on and having to break down and get more clothes in the bigger sizes, again. How did I celebrate or commiserate these changes? Yep, you guessed it, food. Maybe food wouldn't have been such an issue for me if I'd been active, but I wasn't. I hated running, I wasn't involved in any sports, and my attempt at workouts consisted of watching a video at home and attempting to show motivation. Today, I've been a gold member for one year, and I'm also celebrating a milestone for workout number 700. What? That's crazy, you say, right? What about the food and the overeating and not being active? How ever could I have accomplished this? Where I am today is a combination of motivation, determination, and a lot of hard work. But I will be honest, it's also tears, injuries, frustrations, and yes, overeating. I might not have been strong throughout this year, but I had strength and everybody's strength is built differently. Mine was built on routine. Routine was attending at least one class every morning, continuously, routinely. Whether I was tired, had a day off of work, or just didn't feel like it, I got my button gear and I got to the blue. Not every workout was 100%, but I was there and I kept coming back. And now that routine is so much a part of me that I schedule my life around Fit Club instead of Fit Club around my life. Yes, my weight has increased sometimes. Yes, my body fat has increased sometimes. Yes, my muscle mass has decreased sometimes. Yes, I've been weaker and not able to lift as much, run as fast or jump as high as previous days. But those are all part of my life because this is what Fit Club is to me, my life. I've got many more years of life to get through and lots of time to get it all figured out. It has only been recently after hitting some emotional lows that I finally opened my eyes to who I am and what I have accomplished to appreciate the lows of life as lessons, building on them, to reach for new highs, to stop looking back and saying, if only, because nothing is gonna change those fries into carrots, no matter how hard I wish it. But it is time to stop punishing myself and instead accept myself and appreciate my accomplishments. Yes, I have smaller size clothing now. Yes, I can lift heavier and jump higher and run faster than I could a year ago. But to me, those are just bonuses. That saying about it taking a village Fit Club is the village. Everybody in the village has their own stories, goals, and roles. The village has all of the conveniences you need. Coaching, nutrition, encouragement, and those are available for everyone. But it is up to each individual what they want to take advantage of and when. And I owe this village for my biggest wins, all because I chose to invest and believe in myself. I have friends. I can laugh, cry about this now, but it's such an amazing win for me. Being in the military, you aren't always somewhere long enough or even home for enough time to be able to make honest and true friends that are not work-related. And they really like me, they've told me so. All I had to do was ask and they were already there just waiting for me to open my arms to them. And I'm an inspiration. This one means so much to me. My mantra this last year has been Jim is my therapy, but sharing my story has also been my therapy. To have people come up to me or to comment on my posts that I'm inspiring is absolutely amazing. It's not just my stories either, it's on the blue. It took some great people to make me realize what I could accomplish if I put my mind to it. So yes, I feel so accomplished when I go full stack, or I take the 50 pound dumbbells for myself, or add more risers to the box step. And it feels so good to encourage that person next to me to go a bit higher or faster, or to just try using this weight instead. Because that look of accomplishment on their face when they realize what they are capable of is just the best feeling in the world. It was June 2018 that I stepped out of my comfort zone only to discover now how comfortable I really am with myself, with the future, and so damn excited to see where this next year is gonna take me and where I'm gonna take myself to. I do know one place I will be taking myself to, and that's Fit Club West.